Hey guys, welcome to another video. I'm gonna take this off. Um, today we are going to be playing a game called Dot Work. I got it loaded. Minecraft Hour of Cord Code. So let's play. Hmm. Minecraft Designer, Minecraft Adventure. I say adventure means regular. Alright. My name is Ian Spare and Steam, but I'm better known as Jeb. I'm the lead developer of Minecraft oh, here at Mobile yeah. in Stockholm. I think I was 11 or maybe 12, and I started the uh, programming because I wanted to make games, and one of my father's friends told me that in order to make games, you need to learn to how to program. So, that, so that's how I got started. But I, I like the designing and figure out, figuring out the <laughs> architecture of, of things. So if you yes, don't know, Jen or whatever his name I've got, oh, Jeb, yeah. Jeb is going to play the creator of, of Minecraft. By programming Alex or Steve to move through a simulated piece of a Minecraft world. Traditional programming is usually Alex, but today we use Blocks, a system which uses visual blocks that you can drag and drop to write programs. Under the hood, you are creating JavaScript code. The concepts that you'll be learning are what computer programmers use every day and are at the foundation to computer science. Here at Mojang, we use these same concepts to make Minecraft work. Before we start, you'll pick your character. I'm going to choose Alex. Let's build code for a program that will help her move around the screen. Your screen is split into three main parts. On the left is the Minecraft play space, where your program will run. The instructions for each level are written below. This middle area is the toolbox, and each of these blocks is a command that directs Alex's actions. The white space on the right is called the workspace, and this is where we build our program. If we drag the move forward block to our workspace and then click run, what happens? Alex moves forward one space on the grid. Pretty cool. And what if we wanted to do something after she moves forward one space? We can add another block to our program. I'm going to choose the turn right block and I'll drag it underneath my move block until this orange line appears. <laughs> then I'll drop it and the two blocks will snap together. When like we press puzzle. run again, Alex will perform the commands that are stacked from top to bottom in our workspace. <laughs> and if you ever want to delete a block, just drag it from the stack back to the toolbox. To undo your changes and get back to how the level started, use the Start Over button in the top right corner of the workspace. One more thing. You see the little triangle on the top box? Uh, thing. It's like a dolphin in like the box. Let's start coding. Box. It's pretty cool. Alright, so we're going to that. Let's do Alex, because She's a girl and girl powers best. Okay. Add a second move forward command to reach the sheep. Okay. Hit run to try your to try your program. So like he says, let's do that. Uh, is that what we need to do? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Puzzle 1 completed. Congratulations. You just wrote two lines of of code. Show code. I think I'm gonna continue. Level 2, I guess, because it says 2. Alright, what is a very important resource? Many things are made from it. Like, one stuff. Houses, stuff like that. Crafting tables, chests. Walk, walk to the tree and use and use destroy block. Command to chop it down. All right. Well, according to my calculations, we need that. And then that. Boom! Let's hit run. Yeah. Let me guess. We're gonna do a lot more. 
Puzzle 2 completed. You just wrote three lines of code. All time total five lines of code. Show code? No, let's continue. Level 3. Sh sheep sh shearing time. Okay, let me do that more. Sheep, sheep shearing time! Use the shear command to gather wool, wool, wool <laughs> from both sheep. Alright, so we need that. Alright. Um. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I'm a bit sick. Hold up, guys, I got it. Okay, that should be good for now. Alright. Move forward. And then... Here. And then we gotta turn... That's right. Move forward. Move forward. And come left. Let's do this. I don't know. Okay. Oh shit, I forgot to do reset. No, no, no. I forgot to do here. Or, let me see what does before I do here. Alright, so I don't need this anymore. I know, I know Alex. Who's testing. Whoops. Here. Okay, so we need this to go here, and this to go here, and then let's do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Girl power. Okay, puzzle three completed. Congratulations. You just wrote... <laughs> Six lines of code. All time total, 11 lines of code. Show code? No, let's continue. Level four. We need to build a house before the sun goes down. House requires a lot of wood. Cut down three trees. Jeez, All right, move forward, move forward. Left. Turn left. Move. Okay, so one, two, three. One, two, three. And then turn right and move forward. Let's see what it does for now. Let's touch that. Okay, so all of these need to go. Hmm. Let's see what it does right now. Alright. Destroy block. Let's see what it. Let's see if I have the right um direction. Mm -hmm. 
Ah, perfect. Perfecto. Let's run, baby. All right, puzzle four completed. Congratulations, you just wrote 14 lines of code. All time total, 25 lines of code. So code, now let's continue. Level five. Oh, okay. I'm Lydia Winters, Winters Mine's brand director, and we made a little game called Minecraft. Uh huh. Oh yeah, the my favorite thing to do in Minecraft, Minecraft is explore. I love adventuring in caves and seeing what I can find. Huh. As, As someone, someone who isn't a programmer, I'm really, really excited, excited to go through the Minecraft lessons and actually learn some coding myself. <laughs> the last level needed lots of move forward blocks. It would be easier if we could just tell the computer to perform the move forward command four or five times. Luckily for us, computers are really good at repeating commands with repeat loops. When building Minecraft, we use repeat loops to place all the initial materials for creating a new world. That's thousands and thousands of blocks. We also use loops I know that because, for example, oh, to make a computer use back and forth as she walks. Mm -hmm. Repeat loops are a powerful part of programming. Night is coming, so in the next couple of levels, we're going to build a house to stay safe. We're going to use the repeat block to do this very easily. To build the wall of our house, we can either tell Alex to move forward and place planks four times, or we can tell her to move forward and place one plank that takes this command and use the repeat block to have her perform the action multiple times. Now we'll click on the repeat block and tell her how many times we want her to perform this action. Now let's build our house before night falls. Yeah, I better do that. Alright, well let's build our house, shall we? Uh, Alright, so... Let's do but porch. Let's do it three times, because there's three dirt blocks on the... That's actually four. Oh yeah, no, no, no. Take that out. Take that in. There we go. Let's run. Alright. Well, let's do this. This now. Let's do this. There we go. There we go. There we go. Ta da! Alright. Um. Oops, I forgot to read that. Puzzle 5 completed. Congratulations. You just wrote three lines of code. All time. T total 28 lines of code. So, code? Mm -hmm. No! Level 6. Whoa. Uh. That does look hard. I think I'm gonna go for easy because I'm a wimp. Okay. Let's do this, baby. <laughs> do ba do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Does it have eight? Yes, it does. Um, okay. Let's reset. One, two, three, four. Turn right. Four. Let's have another one of this. One, two, three. 
One, two, three. Five times. Hard with the repeat clock. Stop, 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 stop. Okay, well, let's take this off. Uh, uh, hmm. No. Again. Mm. No! You idiot! It's not that hard to build a house, isn't it? Right, so Minecraft? What am I doing wrong? And this don't mind that, guys. That's just my dad's phone ringing. All right, hold up. So let's replace these. Left turn right. forward and then place down if this doesn't work I don't know Again. Let me watch that. Mm -hmm. oh, uh. mm. What to what is Honestly, guys, um, that has to end it for today. We'll do a part two. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and toodles!